my name is Nicole Smith, and this is my objective speech. I chose to do it on my Border Collie, River. River is a three-year-old, purebred, American Border Collie Association registered Border Collie. And she is both a working dog and a beloved pet. Um, I fell in love with Border Collies about eight years ago when I was working at a doggy daycare. We had a young Border Collie puppy come into daycare. His name was Luke, and I absolutely fell head over heels in love with him. For his personality, just his antics, everything about him, I absolutely loved him. So he inspired me to get my first dog, and it was Border Collie. Um, I got River as a tiny little eight-week-old puppy, and right from the start, she was absolutely crazy. She's a very intense working dog. Um, she's very hard-headed. It, it takes a lot to get through to her. But once she's got it, she's great. Um, She's taught me lots of things as both a trainer and a behavioralist, um, which is what I'm going to school for. Um, for one thing, she taught me to better read dogs. I really had, uh, not that I had a hard time with it before, but she definitely introduced me to how to pick up on behaviors ahead of time and correct them before I have problems rather than noticing a problem and trying to correct it afterwards. Um, she definitely taught me a lot about having patience because she was so hard-headed and everything like that when she was a puppy. Um, and she also really taught me the difference between the learned and inherited behaviors. A lot of behaviors we see in dogs nowadays are learned behaviors, meaning we, you know, even unbeknownst to ourselves, have taught the dog something. Whereas with a, a Border Collie, they have a lot of inherited herding instincts. So, you know, you have to learn what's the difference between chasing the cat and trying to herd it, stuff like that. Um, so, I definitely learned, have learned a ton of different stuff from her. And because she's been such an intense dog, um, she inspired me to try sheep herding. And I have been herding now for about two years. Um, it's become both a hobby and an obsession of mine. Um, it led me to buy six sheep, and I also bought two other border collies that are at home that are a little bit younger than her. Um, Sam, who's a tricolor, and Cricket, who is another black and white, but she's a smooth coat. Um, in the sheep herding, there's three different levels of competition. There's novice, which is for green or beginners, absolute bottom level, very easy stuff. There's pro novice, which ups the ante a little bit. Um, it's a little bit harder course, bigger distances. And then there is open, which is the kind of things, I mean, you can go to nationals for open, and it's the high level stuff. It's the stuff you see televised from Wales or England or anything like that would be the open level. Um, and there is a, another class called nursery. Nursery is for dogs under three years of age that can run a pro-novice course. Um, it's quite an honor to be able to run in nursery. It means both the dog is good enough and the handler is good enough to bring them to that level at such a young age. It's more common to hit pro-novice at um, about five years of age, maybe four, sometimes three, but hardly ever under three. And my Sam dog, because of what I learned with River, is actually running nursery. And he's only a year and a half, so oh, cool. he's a pretty good dog. Um, River also taught me how to better read sheep body language, which I was surprised. It's not something I thought I would learn very easily, but because of all the different behaviors I see out of her, I learned to be able to read the sheep and how to react to the sheep from a football field or two away. Um, River definitely led me to be a better novice handler. I am to the point now where I am almost ready to drop my novice title as a handler and move, up, move it up a level. Um, she is almost ready for open level competition, so she's definitely taught me a ton of different things about everything. Um, all in all, Riv is one of my best friends. She's more than just a working dog and a beloved pet for me. She is <laughs> my everything. Um, she's taught me how to better read and understand body language and all different kinds of animals. And she's definitely given me more confidence in things because when you're standing up in front of 200 people showing how, how well your dog competes, you know, it's pretty heavy stuff to have to go up in front of that many people that you don't know and most people are better handlers than me at this point in time. So, hope you enjoyed learning a little something about River and I. This one? Yeah.